Rock climbers who made history in Yosemite are back on solid ground and telling their story. Ken Bastida reports they may be in the record books, but well, right now they just want some rest. Yeah. Ken? Can you blame these guys, Alan, Veronica? These guys just conquered what many thought was impossible. They free climbed El Capitan's Dawn Wall, and that's the hardest way you can do it using only your hands and your feet. That is an experience that was exhilarating, they say, and exhausting, and today is still just beginning to sink in. Honestly, the thing that hurts the most right now are our legs from hiking down because we haven't used them in 19 days. Walking may be a challenge, but Santa Rosa's Kevin Jorgensen is basking in a dream come true. It's an emotional roller coaster, and pulling onto the top was a relief to have that roller coaster come to a stop. He and climbing partner Tommy Caldwell from Colorado are the first to free climb the Dawn Wall route on El Capitan. I think we've been exposed to almost like a drug of like dreaming really big and pursuing those things that I know for me that just I need that. Caldwell lost his voice yelling to his partner during the climb. The journey took a physical toll on both men. The two were grasping thin, small cracks and ripping the skin on their hands in the process. My hands are beat. I wake up every morning and I have to take 800 milligrams of ibuprofen just to brush my teeth. The climbers used ropes only to catch them when they fell, which Jorgensen did almost a dozen times. Still, he says, the struggle was worth it. At least for me, when you would grab that last hold, you could literally feel all the, the hope and desire and stress just like drip off of you and you're just hanging there in silence and relief and joy and it's like the coolest feeling. Despite their history making feet, the two are staying humble. I hope that everyone that's been following along can take the Don Wall as an example of what's possible and find their own Don Wall. There you go. The men plan to return to El Cap tomorrow to remove all their safety ropes that they installed along the way. That's standard operating procedure, guys. You go back up, you clean the wall back off for the next guy. This time, they'll use ropes, though, and climbing gear. Should be done in a couple of hours. Alan? Pack it you. in, you pack it out. Yep. All right, Ken.